This time, I'm going to show you subtraction still using our make 10 method. Okay, so we've got them there. So if we had a question such as 43 take away 25. Okay, 43 take away 25. First, I'm going to show it on my number line. Okay, so we've got something to work with. My 43 being subtraction is going to go at this end. Okay, 43. Now, 25 we know has two tens and five ones. So I'm going to do my jumps of 10 first. 43, take away that jump of 10 is going to be 33. Take away that jump of 10 is going to be 23. So we know, having done our 10s, we're now down at 23. Okay. So we're just taking away our 1s. 23, take away our 5. Okay, so as we've got them there. Well, if we know in order to get down, to the next multiple of 10, we're going to need to take away 3, which will leave us with 20. Okay, and to take away those 3, 1, 2, 3, okay, which gets us to 20. Now, from our 5, if we've used 3, our remaining number is going to be 2. So we can just do our last two jumps, our 20, take away 2 equals 18 or counting back on our number line 20 19 18 so our answer to 43 take away 25 is 18 but it's all about getting back to those multiples of 10 okay so at 23 okay, you can come back to your multiple of 10 and do your final two partitioning that five